Hey guys, what's going on? You're watching T-Bone Tech, and in this video, we are going to be comparing the Ray-Ban Aviators against the Ray-Ban Clubmasters. So first off, we're going to talk about the Ray-Ban Clubmasters. This particular pair that I have right now has 51 millimeter lenses, and it also has a 21 millimeter bridge, and this is the large size of the Ray-Ban Clubmasters. This pair of Ray-Ban Aviators has 62 millimeter lenses and also has a 14 millimeter bridge and this is the large size of the Ray-Ban Aviators. First off, these Ray-Ban Aviators have pilot shaped lenses and the frames are very thin to help them not get in the way of your vision. The original Ray-Ban Aviators were designed for American Air Force pilots. And because of that, they're going to be great for when flying an airplane. And they're also going to be great for those of you who have a driver's license instead of a pilot's license. They're going to be absolutely great for when driving. And that's because these sunglasses completely wrap around the face, offering very good coverage from the sun. They're also extremely lightweight, and they have these very small, thin frames, which aren't going to get in the way of your vision. They're just going to kind of wrap around the face and completely immerse you with their glass lenses which provide UVA and UVB protection. Now the Ray-Ban Clubmasters on the other hand definitely aren't going to be the best for when driving but they're definitely going to get the job done. The reason why they're not going to be the best for when driving or when outdoors a lot is because there's pretty big gaps here on the sides of the sunglasses to let sunlight in. They do offer good protection from the sun but nothing anywhere close to as good as the Ray-Ban Aviators do. The Ray-Ban Clubmasters have acetate frames and then the lower part of the lens frame is actually made out of metal along with the nose bridge. They're also going to have these two iconic metal accents here in the top corners of the sunglasses. In this particular pair of Ray-Ban Clubmasters that I have here in this video look the exact same as a normal pair of Ray-Ban Clubmasters, but they do have these two extra metal accents and that is because this pair is indeed a folding pair of Ray-Ban Clubmasters. The Ray-Ban Aviators, however, have all metal frames, but they do have very comfortable acetate earrests. Metal earrests would probably Probably not be that comfortable. So Ray-Ban decided to put all acetate e-rest on the sunglasses and they definitely do help with comfort. Both these pairs of sunglasses are made in Italy and they're going to sit here in the inner left temple of the sunglasses on both the Ray-Ban Aviators and the Clubmasters. The Ray-Ban Aviators have very premium all metal hinges which feel very nice when opening them up and when closing them. And that's the same case with these Ray-Ban Clubmasters. They also have all metal hinges. These Clubmasters have a painted on Ray-Ban logo here in the top corner of the sunglasses. This particular pair has polarized lenses and they're also going to have an etched RB logo here in the middle of the left lens that's going to also be there for authentication purposes. Now moving on to the Ray-Ban Aviators, we can see that they also have a painted on logo, but this particular pair of sunglasses does not have polarized lenses, so it's not going to have that P after the Ray-Ban. And again, moving over to the left corner of the lens is going to be a etched RB logo in the middle left lens. Both of these sunglasses feel very solid in the hand. They feel like they are built out of very high end materials materials and they definitely are. As far as pricing goes, a pair of non-polarized Ray-Ban aviators are going to cost you around $150 on Ray-Ban's website, but you can actually pick these up on Amazon for around $120. Now moving on to the Ray-Ban Clubmasters, these again cost about $150 on Ray-Ban's website, but again, you can pick these up on Amazon for around $115. So if you guys are interested in current pricing and availability of either one of these sunglasses, I'm going to have a link in the description down below where you guys can check that out. Both the Ray-Ban Clubmasters and the Ray-Ban Aviators have all glass lenses and they're extremely sharp when looking through them. The quality of Ray-Ban's glass lenses is definitely top notch and they provide 100% UVA and UVB protection. They're both classics and I personally couldn't choose one over the other. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, definitely make sure to give this video a big thumbs up down below and of course make sure to subscribe to this channel and then be notified when I release new videos to this YouTube channel. Again, thank you all so much for watching this video and I'll catch you all in the next one.